Big crack. Yeah, that's about it. One, two, three. Yeah. Okay, I'm pulling up the window because I don't want people watching me. I don't care. Guess who's back? Back again. Nicola's back. Tell a friend. Guess who's back? Guess who's back? Guess who's back? Guess who's back? Back. 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 It's Nicola. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Cool. Grand. Okay. What's up, guys? How's it going? And welcome back to another podcast. Now, this is, we're almost on our actual 100th episode. Are we? Yes. I don't know what number it is on at this stage? Um, I think this is number 98 or 99. <laughs> we never know. No, so I'm not even going to say it anymore. Um, I don't like saying it. Uh, I know, when we reach our 100th episode, I will then say it. This could be it, but I don't think it is. I think we're one or two more away from it anyway. Um, right, so let me just, you know say the thing that's right clear and um, we're not in the studio and the reason why we don't want to be in the studio is because i think this is more natural and nickel is back and we can do it in our own time we don't have to be on studio hours and be formal yeah because what we used to do is, is if you're you know if you're only watching this podcast now recently is that we actually used to do this in the car um, what's that? Last year. Yeah, last year. Um, and we used to do it during the pandemic as well. And we'd get Starbucks drive through and we'd actually do that. And you actually got a drink. What drink did you get? I got, uh, for the first time, a tall pumpkin cream cold brew, right? Look at the how orange, right? Let me, let me. It you is. You put it up there. Now, right, so for the actual, hold on, I'm just going to pop that there. Now, so for the listeners on the YouTube channel, you can see right now uh, this. You can see the colours of it and so. Okay. But so keep that image in your head, right? Radio. And now look at the advertisements, right? Yeah, I want to see advertisements. So the advertisements will be up on the screen right now. So let me show you for those of you watching. Right? I, I, can I, you I can't be. I can't be. Oh God! Sorry, this must be an awful for the uh, <laughs> um, the audio there listeners. There's the picture. Right. That does not look like this. No, it doesn't. It doesn't. Okay. It do- doesn't look so like I'll, it whatsoever. I'm quite sad, but yeah. I still have to taste it, so it could redeem itself. Right. So yeah. Um. I'm so. Sure. Rip it. Yeah. Thank you. Right. So um, for the audio listeners that listen on Spotify, hello, oh welcome God. back. Oh my God. Jesus, that's so satisfying ASMR. Um, so for the people that um, are listening on Spotify, hello, welcome back. Um, it's probably oh. so confusing right now. But, that is uh, pumpkin <laughs> right. But for the people on YouTube, hello, welcome back also. Um, yeah, so we're going to start doing it. Got to get that ice creamer sound. Right, we're going to start just okay. be doing these in the car. Let me talk. Sorry, I need to let, taste it. Let me, we're going to... We're going to be doing it in the car from now on uh, because I think the, the studio, it's too... There's no fun. I think because we have to look at the levels and everything like that, there's no fun in it anymore. So I think we're just going to stick with myself and Nicola doing uh, episodes and you know talking about stuff that we've done during the week uh, in the car from now on. People get it. Can I taste this? Sure. Go My on. hand has gone cold now, so I want to put it down. I don't, I don't know if I'm going to like this. Okay, here we go. That's how that's why it look. No. I don't think I'm a fan. And is this the pumpkin spice that you wanted to try? Yeah, because it's cold. It's but is this actual pumpkin pumpkin spice yeah. what people like? Yeah. No, it's not. No, it's not. No, that can't be it. No, Ugh, no I don't think I like pumpkin or cinnamon. And if people don't know, it's right. It is now September. It's September. Ah! <laughs> No, it's cold. That was really cold. Um, if people don't know, it's that I'm wearing like kind of what dark orange, and you're wearing plum. plum. So this is optimal. Um, this is the optimal episode. Maybe we don't know what the name. Coming back into it. Coming back into it. back. Yes, yes, yes. Now come here. Look, you've been out for a while now, right? So if you want to talk, you need to grab the mic and okay. put it towards you because I can't keep going back over and and back. So if you want to start. On the plus side, I did get an item to eat. <laughs> We're not making this a mook bang. Okay, You're gonna have I, to wait. You're gonna have to wait. Test. Of what? It's what is it? Terminal. It's a bountiful brownie. Right. Okay, so it's new to new boy. the menu. Yeah. Right. Okay. Will you do a smell test with me? No. Put that out to the camera and I'll, I'll tap it. Smell. Oh, that's. Oh. No put smell. up to. You now let me. This, I'm so sorry to Spotify listeners again. So describe it for the Spotify. I would say it looks like a brownie on the bottom, but then it has a layer of coconut crumb 
inside, then it's topped with chocolate and sprinkled with coconut on top as well. It's quite heavy. Lovely. Right, go on, take a bite. Taste test. Anything? I'm not getting much of a coconut flavour. But it looks like there's a lot of coconut in there. Mmm. To be honest, I'm not getting much of a chocolate flavour either. Hey, it's not satisfied with our return that you came back and now you're not actually... Your pumpkin spice didn't go well and now this didn't go well. You know, I tried pumpkin spice latte last year. Did not like it. I tried the iced one now this year. I think it's the pumpkin. I, I think you're not a pumpkin person. You're not just... A, you're not a pumpkin gal. No. No. But you I do like the whole aesthetic. Yeah. Yeah, you might not be a pumpkin gal. No. Right, so we want to get into it straight away. We want to see what the story is. So, um, we... Fall and pumpkins and autumn. Yeah, um, we went to the cinema last night to see uh, the new film, Fall. <laughs> um, it's about two women that are spoiler. best friends. Yes, well, we're going to put spoiler here. So, if you want to skip, uh, here's the time right here that you can skip forward to if you don't want to, um, you know, Be get... Spoiled. Yeah. Um, so, it's about um, a woman... Uh, it's about two best friends, two girls, and, you know, one of the girls' um, husbands die on a rock climbing accident when they all went on it. And she's been, like, you know, depressed for, like, over a year. And her friend comes back from adventuring and travelling and asks her to go on this big uh, signal tower, isn't it? Yeah. She wants to go climb the tower. It's, like, the fourth tallest um, in building in America. Yeah. And... Um, she was like, right, come on, we have to go climb it. But her friend hadn't climbed anything since her husband died, so she yeah. was kind of... She has a fear of yeah. foot heights. But she went anyways, and they started climbing. Um, it went quite smoothly, I would say, till they got to the top. You know, no, nothing nothing major happened. Well, until like, they got to the top. throughout the whole time they were climbing up, uh, you see lo uh, loose screws yeah, uh, like start coming off. Was shaky and... And everything was rusty as fuck. Yeah. So... They made it to the top. I, I, um... I wasn't expecting much from this film whatsoever, but I then realised, hey... By the time, I, yeah, by the time it finished, I was like, oh, fuck, this is actually a really good film. I yeah. thought it was going to be, like, you know, a quick sell, a quick make, um, and, and so, but it actually turned out that there was a really good twist in it, mm. uh, because the girl, they obviously, they're up really high, they're up 2,000 feet in the air, yeah. and uh, they're, they have no war, and so, no food, and they can't get down, they have no signal on the phone, and her friend dies, but... You don't know that until the end because you, you see that she's actually sunstroked and she's actually gone a bit mad and that when she asks her friend for a shot of her shoe to put her phone in it to kind of, you know, put it down to reach signal, she says that she's no longer there. She goes, I'm down there and you, it shows that she actually died trying to get back up. And But the, the film make it looks like she actually got back up but she yeah. didn't. Yeah, it looks it makes you think like she's still alive but she actually isn't. Yeah. It's There were some gruesome parts in it. Um... Yeah. You had to flinch a lot of the time. Yeah. I didn't. I watched it. But, yeah. It, it just showed how much you need to change and adapt in order to survive. Yeah. And what you'd actually go through and put yourself through to be able to survive. It's it's survival of the fittest. That's what they say in the film a few times. Um, and, no, I think that me, you, and a friend of ours, that I'm not going to name her name because she would probably wouldn't want her name mentioned, so um, a friend of ours went to see it, and we, straight after, we all, while the trailer, or while the credits were going up, we were all kind of like, hey, they should have done this, they should have done that, and we kind of debunked it. Yeah, we found a couple of different ways they could have actually saved themselves instead, yeah. and they were like, why didn't they just do this, and I was like, oh my god. I think it's just because of the film, they have to write it that way to make it exciting. Yeah. yeah. It's, and so, um, but that was the film Fall, anyway, if you want to go see your shorts um, and we probably spoiled the fears but uh, if not Other we recommend that we seen recently was bullet train bullet train was amazing oh, that was good yeah i didn't i didn't expect you to like it that much it's very funny very quick very fast a lot of action it just keeps you entertained the whole way through the dialogue is really good yeah the characters are really good uh, tangerine and lemon 
Tangerine and Lemon. Oh my god, I forgot about them. For you 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 like them? I think the most. Yeah, the guy that plays Kickass, he's. Yeah, he was really good in it. He was actually really good in that film. I did not know that was him. Casey had to tell me from the first time I went because I went two times. I went a second time with you and our and our friend. Yeah. Um, and you and our friend noticed it straight away, and I went, "How do, how did they know?" I got, usually I'm good at faces, like, but I did not. He's the good-looking guy from Angus Town. Well. What? Yeah. Say that again. He's the good-looking guy in Angus Town. Hold on, I just needed to kick kick Nick <laughs> kick Nick out of our car. Nothing. No, that's okay. You can like who you want. We we said this already. Thanks. Um, yeah, but no, um, Nicola, you want to go to a dog park or a dog run? Why do you want to get up on your phone? Yeah, the like there's no flow into it. No, there's no point because, um, well, speaking of fast moving, pacing, that's what dogs do. Dogs are well, fast. You and lead into it. Don't just. Yeah, I will lead into it. Dogs have lids, and then and that's I'm leading into it. Ah, <laughs> good one. Right, so um, Nicola wants to go to this. Um, you could actually go as well if you just wanted, because we're going this Sunday. So by the time you watch this, it will be Monday the fifth when you are watching. So you still have time to actually watch it uh, to go if you just wanted. It's a whole dog run. What's it called? Right, so it's called Pups in the Park. Not sponsored, but we would love to be. I'd love to be as well. Some dog stuff. We would love that. Yeah, we have two pugs, me and Penny. Um, one's a Chihuahua pug. One's a pug. Um, we actually have news about that as well, about something that we're doing, but I don't think we should na- mm. do anything until. But it's very exciting, and I, I can't wait. Yeah, keep your eyes open, um, because it's going to be very exciting what we're going to be doing uh, soon. Right, so go on. Do you want to give us a little okay. video? So it's called... Do you want me to take this off your hands? Yes. yes. Hello, everybody. Yep. You're in my hands. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Okay. Is this close enough? Perfect, yeah. Right, so it's called Pups in the Park and it's in Marley Park next weekend. Mm. The, I want to say 9th and 10th of September. Yeah. Okay, so we're thinking of going to Sunday. So if anyone's there, say hi to us. Sure. No, <laughs> no one cares. Our it. two followers, please come over and say hi. Yeah, Sarah and James. <laughs> Sarah and James are the only ones that watch this podcast. Okay, so yeah, we're thinking of going to Sunday. So you only know the first thing. So I started reading this earlier and she's like, stop! Save for the podcast. Yeah. Get my initial reaction. Yeah, get a reaction. I want to. I want to know what you like. Oh, this is good. I like the. Re- <laughs> yeah, this. Um, no, we still haven't bought two microphones, as you can see. I, yeah. Well, we should invest in that now. Knowing that we're getting the car, you can get two splitters, yeah. and but we need two microphones. Yeah. You can get a little small microphone, put it there, or someone yeah. just talk. Yeah, we'll do that. Yeah, so we don't have to keep doing this because this this does get a bit annoying, doesn't it? Um, but yeah, go ahead. No, you were talking about your reaction. Oh yeah, I wanted to see my reaction. So what do we have here? What okay. features? So also we're talking. <laughs> you, you, it's a nice you, fade out. Yeah, you wait that. Yeah, so I want to talk there. What features? <laughs> it's a fade out. Right, fade go, go, okay, go, go, go. Manually. <laughs> okay, so they have the schedule for both days, and I'm. Do you want the window down yeah, now? Please. Are you too hot? Yeah, it's very warm. <laughs> now, we all happy? We ready? Yeah. Come on. Okay. Right. So for the Sunday, so yeah, the only thing you know first is the first thing up, and then you stopped me abruptly right at the second thing. So yeah. right, here's your reaction. Okay. okay. Bear in mind, right? We're going for the whole thing. Half nine to half five, we're no, gonna be there. Yes. What happens if it's raining? Bring an umbrella. Will you put that on me if I'm talking? <laughs> you, do you not see what you just done? I goes, will you put that on? You, you, my, that went in my mouth a little bit. <laughs> it's okay, it's covered in earth a bit. Um, yeah. <laughs> if I'm gonna talk, just be quick Sorry, reaction. I'm for reaction. I like my. But you were doing it quick for you. <laughs> my hand wasn't remembered. Right, what, what's the features? Okay. So yeah, we're going to be there half nine to half five. If it's raining, we're bringing jackets. The dogs have jackets, so yeah, we'll be ready. Okay. <laughs> okay, so first thing, 9.45 a.m. Pet-friendly Dublin fashion show. Reaction. Uh, that's ridiculous. Do you want me to read into it? No. Just read the oaks and then okay. venting kind of... <laughs> <laughs> If anything kind of sp- no no no. If anything kind of spurts out, like spits out, I'll, I'll ask I'll ask questions about it. Okay, so no questions. Oh my god, you can win prizes. Okay. Are we in? No. Are we entering the dogs in any of this? No, I don't think you do. Can you can you do that? Maybe. Just look into it. Yeah, we could do that. Oh my god, you can. <laughs> right, we'll we'll look into that. Some. We gotta get them costumes. Just. See. Okay. Right. Just see what else is there. <laughs> right, if I need a Spotify list, there's what's happening now. Nicola just had to fix our glasses and she forgot to talk. <laughs> okay, next. 10.35am. 
breed me up Bichons. Okay. How do you feel about how do you feel about Bichons? I actually don't what what do they look like? They're the little white fluffy ones. Yeah, they're cute. They are cute. I cannot wait to see a whole park, right? And I'm presuming they have like little sections off. And you just see a whole little field full of the same breed, and you're like, "Where's my dog? You're gonna have to put." Yeah, like, I think I think you can spot me out of everybody. Well, yes, but wait. Yeah, <laughs> everybody, I didn't get that because she pulled the mic away from me. But yeah, but Penny would be kind of difficult. Yeah, but what I mean is, you just walk in and you see a whole little section, and it's just white because it's full of bichons. Yeah. Right. Okay. Next. 11 a.m. Irish working sheepdogs, sheep herding demonstration. I love this. I would love watching sheepdogs rile in sheep. It's just, it's so entertaining to me. How come? They have to listen to all the whistles and like the clicks and things that the owners is telling them to do to how to, <laughs> to how to rile up the sheep. It's just fascinating. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's, sorry, the window came down, I was gonna have to do this, but yeah, no, it's cool, alright, yeah, it's, it's alright, yeah. So that'll be fun, right? 11.35am, breed me up Shih Tzus. How do you feel about Shih Tzus? Alright, can we get on with it now? Okay, oh, right, okay, 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 right, it's a long day ahead, we're only at 12 o'clock, right, 12 o'clock, Dublin Wicklow Mountain Rescue Team, search and rescue demonstration. Okay. Ooh. Okay. 12.35 a.m. Breed me up dash ones. A little party for sausage dogs. Uh, yeah, we'll have to go to that now because that'll be fun. <laughs> Sorry. But that'll be fun. Give me that. Cause, give me that because you're so bad at the mic. Yeah, no, that'll be that'll be really good to actually go and do. Okay. 1 p.m. Bally Bogey Flyball Club demonstration. I don't know what that means. What's a flyball? Just keep continuing. We'll figure it out and we can talk about it when we come back for the next podcast. 1.35 p.m. Breed me up terriers. That's going to be a mixed bag of everything. Okay. 2 p.m. Oh, Dublin Wicklow Mountain Rescue Team. Again, a search and rescue one. Okay, same thing. 2.35 p.m. DSPCA Rescue Reunion. Aww. Opportunity for Rescue reunion As in like Dogs that need to be re- Reunited It says I love an opportunity For DSPCA rescues And their owners To meet up And reunite With staff and volunteers okay. No Oh so if they have Any dogs that went missing That they'll be there And that you can go no. And see your dog there No it's the people That rescued animals The people that adopted animals Can go back and talk To the DSPCA Oh that's nice Staff Okay 3pm yeah. Irish working sheepdogs Okay another sheepdog uh, we are in the frame. Come on in. I'm reading. Right, go on. Okay, another sheepdog demonstration. Okay. Now this one is the one I can't wait for. Sorry. Three thirty-five p.m. Breed meet up pugs. Oh, that'd be good. And me and Penny are going. We're gonna have We're gonna so have many a whole pugs. Little field of pugs. Sorry, come on. We're gonna have a whole little field of pugs. Yeah. This car. Well, I can't wait for it to be like raining again because um, it's, it's really warm. It's really warm in this car. I can't wait. Okay, then 4 p.m. is another flyball demonstration. 5, 4.35, breed up, breed me up spaniels. And then 5 p.m. is a Tamro's Labrador's gun dog display. Oh, obedience and fitness show. <coughs> cool. Okay, so that is like your main area schedule, right? That's just one schedule, okay? Right, we're not doing the whole podcast no, based on that. No, but listen, right? So for the Sunday schedule this is a, a talk stage oh right so Kildare vets talk about their pets do's and don'ts they also talk about how to care for dogs in cool weather helping hounds dog tails from DSPCA and um, we got some charity discussions we got some boredom prevention for your pet interesting okay now listen to this one hounds at Halloween with Rob Walsh, the Irish dog father, and Bobby Ortiz, Dr. Bob. I'm not listening to the dog father and Dr. Bob. I'm sorry, I'm not going there and listening to that now. Okay, the next talk then is do's and Alright, okay, we don't need to know about talks. We just need to know about the events and what what, what was on. The okay, they're the events. So, oh, wait, we're going to go to that. We're going to... Agility arenas for all these different types of breeds. And there's obedience yeah, our dogs are not going to be in obedience. So that sounds very interesting. I think we dragged it on as much as we could um, right now. Um, I can't wait. I'm going to book tickets. 
Yeah, book tickets all you want. Uh, how much are the tickets? I was looking at this, right? So I'll get that information for you. Right, so while Nicola's looking for the tickets, that I just want to say a word from our sponsors. Mm, we don't have any. If you want to sponsor us, let us know. So tickets are standard fees, 18 euro. What? That's good. You're getting a whole day full of activities. Child from 2 to 12 is 12 euro. Children under 2 are free. A family pass for two adults and two children for 56 euro. And dogs are free. Okay. Do imagine they charge our dogs to go into a dog yoke. Yeah, no, so that'd be interesting. We'll give you an update on that when we can. Um you so might see some maybe some vlog footage. Yeah, we're going if you wanna follow our Instagram, we actually have an actual Instagram now called the RA Podcast. Uh, we put up all reels and stuff like that as well and any photos or you know, if you're wondering when we're gonna be uploading, we kinda of put up on the story saying gonna be uploading it. you know, we're doing a podcast now. There's there's some stuff up now if you wanna go watch it. Yeah, so as I said, we're gonna be back in the car now, we're gonna be doing it just me and Nicola. Uh, for a bit I might have a guest on it might be you know in the studio or so but I don't think for we'll be doing that for long I think we're gonna just come back to the car um, from from now on and, and do it cuz I think I feel the most f fun doing a podcast when it's me and you in the car and you know if we had Sarah now the last time we done it was last Halloween Halloween it's been like pretty much a year since we're back and pumpkin spice season so yeah it's been a year. Oh, sorry, yeah, it's okay. Don't. don't it's all right. Don't worry. Um, yeah. So, what has been new with us? Um, what have we been doing? We filmed, finished uh, Strangers in the Night. Um, filmed. It's onto the tour. It's raft. It only needs one or two changes now, and we actually have to get ADR in for our fellow actors, and then. When the Hitman is done, we're hoping to premiere that in November now. Okay, but we're not talking about film stuff here. Well, we just did that. We just talked about the that film. No, I mean like our film stuff. Like, uh, come here, look. Business. We need. We don't want to talk about business. Business. You know. Yeah. Make it fun. Yeah. Well. Well. Well, it is fun. It is like. What happened to you yesterday? You got drenched. I was in work. I had to work and. I was working from half nine. Okay, how was Irish weather so weird? Like yesterday was literally like full on raining for the whole day. Mm. And today it's sunny with 20 degrees. That's one of the many mysteries of life, Nicola. Oh my God, that was the other thing we were meant to talk about. What? Only murders in the building. Right, well. Oh, and Modern Family. Right, well, we can't talk about it now because the podcast is almost over. Yes. So we, we we're leaving you on a cliffhanger <coughs> if he's actually come back. But yeah, um, this has been a fun episode. I really enjoyed it. Um, how do you feel about your first time coming back on? It feels like I'm back in the swing of it. Like I, yeah, yeah, feels good. Maybe next week we prepare ourselves a little bit better because this yeah. week we just kind of wanted to film. We thought we were going to remember all these things, but we clearly didn't. And we we weren't actually going to. We didn't know whether to record it or not, so we didn't really prepare. But we know now that okay, it's going to be a yeah. weekly thing again. Um, we hopefully it. next week we we'll probably get Sarah in to come in mm -hmm. if she if. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. See how we'll, it flows. Yeah, we'll see. If Sarah's with us, we might ask her to come and do a podcast with us. I, I don't see why she wouldn't because she's dying to do another one. Is James not allowed? James can come as well, but um, I don't know if he'd be interested in being in one. But if so, you're more than welcome. Um, but I know for a fact Sarah would jump straight into one. Um, but yeah. So, guys, that's it for this week's episode of the podcast. Um, stay tuned. We're watching more. Go on to our Instagram. The link is down in the description below. And, yeah. Anything else, Nick, before we sign off? I think you need an ice pack. You look like you're a bit, a bit warm there. Are you? Yeah, I'm very warm. Is the sun getting to you? Yeah, it actually is, yeah. Wow. Okay, guys, thanks so much for watching. Remember, it's not the, <laughs> it's not the best podcast. Do you want to say that line again? Okay, guys, and thanks. <laughs> I think I'm having sunstroke. <laughs> I think I'm having sunstroke. Right, guys. Thanks so much for watching. <laughs> thanks so much for watching. Remember, it's not the best podcast. It's not the worst podcast. You just hit It's me just... It's the all right. right podcast. Know, we're just all right. Yeah. This is this is a chaos podcast. This is chaos. Um, right, guys. So, thanks for watching. And bye. 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 Guess who's back? Pumpkin Spice. Back again. He's back. Tell a friend. Guess who's back? Oh my god, this is a. <laughs> bye bye.